all right good day guys and welcome to my youtube channel in our previous lecture we talked about how to create a ribbon in using a data in an excel so today i am going to show you how to add and modify chat data here in an excel okay let's get started now in order to modify chat data here mm -hmm. the first step here is to go to the source table here is our source table right that make up this uh, bar the chart right so you can see that immediately i click on the if i click on the chart here it will definitely show a string a string of box box a rectangular box here, showing me that this is the chart that make up this is the data that make up this chart now let me try to work around the the information on this my source source table here if you actually want to have only personal record to be displaying on my chart here so what i need is to drag this data up drag it up at the you can see at the left at the, at the way i'm dragging it right so drop it now you can see the chart immediately i, I drag it up down to the personal record and showing me the only the personal record for the month of january february march and april 2020 and automatically the bar i mean the the bar chart changes as well so showing the the each and every bar that make up the so you can see remember the the ribbon ribbon we created in the previous lecture you can see that the the amount that make up this bar here is five naira. The amount that make up the so the amount depending on this on this personal record on this bar here is five naira. The one spending on this is six naira. The one spending on this is so but depending on the currency record you are you are using, just to use, use it to the interpret it. Now you can see that the it's personal record for the month of January, February, March, and April, and this are it details of each and every one of them now let me walk around the other, other other ones if i actually want this data to show me both january both january i mean both personnel record local and america so what i need to do is just drag it down here you can see so the the personnel record local management as well has been included in my bar chart here so from my presentation if i actually want to present only a report for personnel local and management so i can actually just eliminate the remaining description here then then left with the only personnel local and management so and representing this my, my chart here so let me see work around another way around if i actually if I, if I if i want to work around the maybe i only need a january reports on my on my personnel because okay the only january report then january stands in report on uh, all my description okay let me say only the january reports in my description so for my presentation so now this report showing me only the January report you can see representing that if I want to present my report on on January record so this is the bar chart this, uh, representing the report now so let me see work around the another way another way I can see work around it uh, when I can work around it so if I uh, okay if i don't want my person, personal record again let me probably change it to non-executive or let me, let me change it to executive executive so what i need to do is to just drag it down to executive yeah
okay all right so let me just drag it down to the executive here. sorry okay yeah can get the okay drag it to the executive here. so you can see that I've eliminated the personal record and local record. So I'm showing it's only showing me the report from the executive down to the world contract stuff there. So you can see, so only from the executive to the contract stuff. So you can work around, you can work around the this the source data here to make your report whenever you want to make your presentation to. To look more beautiful and more readable and make it stand out in your presentation. Thank you and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Bye.